All right, guys, it is time for my favorite part of the show where we pick our FanDuel player to watch for the weekend. And uh, look, tight end has been extremely tough this season. If you don't have Waller or Kelsey, you really, and John New Smith at times, you really are just taking flyers. I think there's a tight end that's emerging that I'm not going to say he's going to get to that level, but the way he's priced on FanDuel right now, I think you can get a lot of value. $4,700 for Tyler Eifert. That's right. I threw a Jacksonville Jaguar up in there. Going against the Minnesota Vikings, 26th on FanDuel overall against the pass. We know Chark is questionable. Conley Jr., we don't know if these guys are going to play. We don't know what receivers will be out there. He's averaging over four targets a game for the last four weeks. And then even he had a two-week break there for a second. He had seven targets way back in, on October 11th against the Texans, which was the last game he played when he was out. I think Tyler Eifert for $4,700 at a tight end position that is just all over the map has tons of value. Tyler Eifert is my FanDuel player to watch this weekend. Okay, my FanDuel pick of the week. Hold on to your seats, guys, because yes, I'm going to say this. It's Mitch Trubisky for $6,900 on field deal now before you turn off this video. <laughs> I know in real life football, Mitch Trubisky can be very frustrating, but we're talking about fantasy football, folks. The same with Carson Wentz. He's frustrating too, but he can still put up good fantasy points for you. And, you know, garbage time, it, it still counts. Last week, Mitch put up more than 20 Fandle points, which is more than Justin Herbert, Josh Allen, and Kyler Murray. This week, Trubisky gets a soft matchup with Detroit, who's given up the seventh most Fandle points to opposing quarterbacks this year. Not only that, but Mitch has historically had the Lions number. In the last matchups, he's put up 19.7, 24.9, 24.3, and 20.8 Fandle points. The Lions have been incredibly generous as well to the wide receiver position. And we saw Trubisky connect with Allen Robinson last week for two touchdowns. By the way, Robinson's still criminally undervalued at $6,900. With the salary you save on Mitch, you can pair him up with Allen Robinson. I'm going for a $6,900 Mitch Trubisky. I know it's crazy, guys, but you got to take some shots. Not much time left. $6,900 on FanDuel. You sold me, Jen. You <laughs> sold me. I don't know how you did it, but you sold me on Mitchell Trubisky.